Hi there, welcome to my personal kitchen. I'm going to share an experiment recipe today with you that I'm trying for the very first time and maybe you'd like to try it as well. It's called detox cabbage soup. Now hold on, don't run away yet. I realize I just used the word detox and I used the word cabbage. Two things that might make you not be very interested in this recipe. However, if you take a moment and research the value of cruciferous vegetables, cabbage being one of those, then you might be interested in trying this cabbage soup. If you also research the value of doing occasional detoxes, then you'll again see why this just could be a good soup to try. Now I've got my phone here with me because that's where I find a lot of my recipes these days. And this particular recipe comes to us from wisemindhealthybody.com. Here's the ingredients that we're going to use. Four cups of cut cabbage. One cup of chicken. This was left over from a roasted chicken that we had in the house three celery stalks cut up, bone broth. This is our personal bone broth that we've made in our house. The recipe calls for two to two and a half cups. I have a tendency to go a little bit over when I make my soups. Salt and freshly ground ginger root. The first thing you need to do is add one teaspoon of ghee or coconut oil or another fat type substance to your soup pan. After you've melted that, the next thing you want to do is add the cabbage and then add the celery. Put it over the heat for a few minutes to let the celery and the cabbage start to soften. So by now, the celery and the cabbage are a little bit more clear in color. They're not completely cooked, but they aren't as crisp as they were before. Typically, the rest of these steps would be done right over your stovetop, but for just the sake of this video, I moved it right back over here to the side of my kitchen. I forgot to mention garlic when I was telling you the ingredients. You need two cloves of garlic, and then you're gonna, ah, I just got garlic in my eye. Woohoo! That you don't wanna do. Whoa, that's an Andy Lynch type thing. I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna be okay. Garlic, so many health properties that garlic can do. I wonder if it can do something good for my eye as well. Okay, that's one clove of garlic. Here goes number second clove of garlic, number two. And this would saute for another minute. It's time to add in the ginger, which I grated. You can use ginger like out of the spice section, but freshly grated ginger that you get in the produce section is definitely the way to go in my opinion. Then you add in one cup of chicken or whatever meat you would like to have and two and a half cups of your bone broth. Heat this all over the stove until you are pleased with the denseness of the vegetables. You can add cilantro through it. You can add more spices if needed. Serve immediately. So how did it turn out? I asked my daughter Grace and her friend Eden to give it their test. And there you have it. The soup is good. Detox cabbage soup.